With me today is Kyle Popper, sales associate, and he's going to tell us a little bit about Normal Colorado, and then we're going to answer some of your questions. Robin, thank you for giving us time today to speak with you and your clients, and thank you for taking the time to listen to you know, the information we have for you. Briefly, Loma, Colorado is Pulte's premier community in the Albuquerque market. We're going to build almost a thousand homes here. We're about halfway done with the neighborhood. We feature about 14 different homes in the community, and our prices range from under 200,000 to up over 400,000 with square footages from 1,600 to approximately 4,200 square feet. The really fun thing about Loma, Colorado is that it's a master plan community that has been built exclusively by Pulte Homes. Mm -hmm. We did all the land development and we're doing all of the homes so we can control the look and the feel and the value and quality of the neighborhood. With that in mind, we have become one of the most prestigious communities in the Albuquerque market and realistically one of the fastest building neighborhoods in the Albuquerque market. Our current market share in Rio Rancho is almost 50% of all new permits pulled within this area. What's surprising though, is not only do we have that prestigious feel, but we're also very affordable. And that's fun to see, with, this, with a home that pretty much fits with just about anybody's lifestyle. Well, let's get into that. With the homes that you have, I noticed you have several different series. Talk to us a little bit about what the different series contain in, and what kind of product that Pulte is delivering at this point. Well, the three product lines we're currently developing here in Loma, Colorado, and as you know, we have changed some of our plans over time, mm -hmm. but the current three that we have, we have the El Bosque series, it's single stories as well as two-story homes from 1,511 square feet to just under 2,500 square feet. The El Bosque series is going to be our more affordable line. It's a little bit thinner lot, but not necessarily small. We have lots in cul-de-sacs, we have extra deep lots, we have lots with views and things of that nature. Um, but our, our Bosque series is going to be realistically running just under and maybe just over, depending on the options you choose, the $200,000 range. Okay. Now that flows into our El Bosque series, which has been one of our fastest selling product lines. Actually, we completely sold out of El Bosque lots right now. Oh my gosh. But we've got the tractors out in the land right now, developing some of our new areas. And within the next two weeks, I'm going to have another 30 to 40 lots ready to go. The El Bosque series, though, has a very unique product line of single story homes that can run just under 2,000 to up to about 2,400 square feet which give us the option for three car garages. Ooh. And then we have two story homes in the, in the series that range from 3,000 square feet up to 4,000 square feet. So that gets us into a little bit larger, uh, larger home range. And then when you go to our next series, our executive level line, and these are the homes that we've had movies filmed in and mm -hmm. things of that nature, uh, would be our Terraza series. And that's gonna give you single story homes in the 3,000 square foot range and two-story homes in the 3,000 to 4,000 square foot, same, foot range with a very high-end level of included features and beautiful home sites. So speaking of some of the options that are available, if someone's looking at the more affordable series, what can they do to make the home pop and how do the options affect the, the floor plans? Well, the surprising thing is most of our options are very, very affordable. And there's some really fun ones that you can do uh, that really make the home exciting. For instance, my first level cabinet up which is really not a very expensive option cost, will get you to a raised panel cabinet and will get you in a, in a variety of color ranges, from the cherry cabinet colors to the new mocha cabinet colors mm -hmm. and so forth. So you can really make the home beautiful and that's where I like to start because the cabinets on your home really set the tone for the other features you're going to put in. Uh, but things such as rounded corners, larger baseboards, very large windows that bring in a lot of light mm -hmm. and just the home designs themselves help enhance that feel of the home. Now, you can get into Corian countertops, granite countertops, and things of that nature. And currently, we do run incentives on the homes that will help offset some of the cost of auctions. Okay. But typically, what we share with people is if you look at the base price of the house and add realistically about 10%. Mm -hmm. So if we're starting with, let's say, the Alameda plan, which is 212000 at base. So you add 10% to it, you're going to be about 232, mm -hmm. And that's going to give you a home that has more options in it than even Really? That'll give you large 18-inch tile floors, beautiful medallions at the entryway, elegant kitchen layouts, and probably a premium lot. Wow, that's very affordable. Speaking of the premium lot, there's so much that everyone does with outdoor living. What can you tell me about the lots that Pulte has available and why there is premiums on some of them? Well, one of the reasons we picked this area is because it's a beautiful hillside location. 
because of the hillside location, many of our lots are terraced within the hillside that open up view opportunities. Okay. We've tried to develop them as well with a lot of north south locations for people or home sites where the backyard faces to the east to capture the beautiful Sandia Mountain views that we have here. So for outdoor living spaces, we've just tried to develop the community itself in a manner to enhance that you know, for all of the homes in the area. But we do have cul-de-sac locations, oversized lot locations, maybe homes that back up to a park or a walking trail and so forth that may have a little bit more cost to them. But what people don't understand is that it, with Pulte homes, the base cost of your land is included in the base price of the house. Okay. So when we're talking about a premium upgrade for a home, you know, unless it's really, really fantastic, <laughs> we're only talking a couple thousand dollars here and there. Um, there will be some, I have the largest premium I've seen in the neighborhood to date is about $30,000. Um, and that's unobstructed Sandia Mountain views on almost a half acre lot in a cul-de-sac that's just absolutely stunning. Uh, but for the most part, you know, a corner lot, maybe a walking trail lot, maybe a lot that has single stories all around it with a little bit of a view, you know, the premiums would be 1500 maybe 3000 if at all. If at all. Yeah, if wow. at all. So another thing that's been especially in the news lately is, you know, we're all very concerned about the, the energy resources that we have. I know Pulte has taken that to heart. What can you tell us about the energy efficiency of your homes? Well, you know, that's very important to Pulte Homes. Uh, Pulte Homes, as a developer and builder, uh, puts a lot of detail and thought into the things that we do. Um, back in 1993, we partnered with the Department of Energy with the Energy Star program and started building green homes at the very beginning. Uh, about two years ago, we were acknowledged by the Department of Energy as the most energy efficient production home builder in the country. And we've only gotten better since then. So here in New Mexico, the energy efficiency is, is exciting to see and how many builders do get involved with that. What we run, though, is a, is a program called Environments for Living. It's okay. above the Energy Star qualifications. And what we do is we build the home in a manner where I can guarantee your costs. You can guarantee heat, the costs? Guarantee the costs wow. to heat and cool your home uh, to a certain temperature. And essentially what we do is we take a look at the entire volume of the house. And then we take a look at the loss coefficient of the home. We take a look at the cost of power and gas to heat and cool, okay. and then we take a look at the temperature. And we figure it out at about 75 degrees. For instance, to come back to that beautiful Alameda plant, mm -hmm. we have one of our best sellers. Uh, that home at 2,088 square feet with 20 foot high cathedral ceilings in the family room mm -hmm. is guaranteed to heat and cool just under $70 a month on an annual average. Well, that's affordable. There. So we have energy efficiency. We have very affordable lot premiums. We have 14 plans to choose from? At least. Oh my gosh. Now, now we do have some more that we're about to bring online as well. Oh my goodness. And we have this great community. What's not to love? I've been asking myself that a lot. It's actually one of the reasons why my family is moving into the neighborhood as well. Wow. Well, Kyle, thank you so much. I really appreciate your time. Any last words of advice for our buyers out there? Well, for the first thing, they've made a great decision by looking at you to represent them. Mm -hmm. so, Robin is one of the best real estate agents I've had the pleasure to work with, and I've been doing this for about 16 years. Secondly, when you're looking at a home builder, there's a few things that you want to make sure that you get. Okay. Double check their home warranty, okay? Double check their rating with J.D. Powers and other uh, customer satisfaction rating facilities, and make sure that they're in a position where they can follow through and complete what you get started. The hardest thing that I see is when somebody gets started on a home and they make the investment and they put their life into it, and then the builder doesn't follow through with what they're going to do. At Pulte Homes, our philosophy is to delight our homeowners and to do the right thing the first time. Wow. I'll never build them a perfect home. I can't. It's not mm -hmm. possible. But we will take care of things through the process. And at the end of the day, hopefully, you'll love the community and want to buy more homes from us in the future. Thanks so much. We'll see you next time.